Uh, Ryan, you guys are obviously coming off a big win on Sunday, your fourth consecutive win. Uh, can you just talk about where this team is trending as a, as a whole right now? Uh, yeah, I mean, obviously, uh, this is the the important time of the year. I mean, we have under 20 games left, so uh, we're making our push right now, and I think uh, things are coming together uh, well for us. Uh, I thought the other night was a, was a really good start to the game, and then we kind of uh, kept getting better and better as the game went on. And uh, against St. Louis, we had a good start, and we kind of let our foot off the gas a little bit. So we got to learn from mistakes like that and keep uh, improving a, as a group here. Can you talk about the confidence of the group as a whole? Yeah, we're definitely uh, definitely playing with more confidence, and we have confidence in in each other and ourselves. And uh, I mean, we've uh, we've played against the best teams in the league and been right there and won some of those games. So I mean, we should be a confident group. We know what we can get done in this. Uh, uh, in this locker room, and uh, obviously it's not going to become easy. But I mean, I think uh, every time that we have a su successful game and go on a bit of a run, it's always uh, it always starts with our work ethic. I know the right side has rotated just a little bit, but on the left side, it's been a staple with Broussard. Uh What's he like as a player and a teammate and a line mate? I mean, great guy for sure. Um, <clears throat> great teammate uh, from what we've seen so far, and uh, to play with him has been has been really good. I mean, he's. Uh, Really smart player. He's always in the right position. Uh, uh, makes those little plays uh, and can just read situations really well. So it's been fun for me uh, to get the chance to play with him so far, and uh, hopefully we keep building the chemistry. But like I said, I mean he's just a really smart player. He, he understands the game well and uh, always puts himself in the right position. Once you get to the playoffs, there aren't too many six-one games. There are a lot of three-two games, two-one games. How do you feel that uh, that you're dedication your focus on defensive play has been going in recent games yeah I mean it's uh, something that uh, we we harp on all the time and um, we we want to keep improving but I think uh, we have taken some steps in the right direction and I think we we are confident that we can get uh, get those three two games two one one nothing games done when it's uh, when it's going to count your assessment of the series with San Jose so far um, yeah, I mean, uh, we know that they play with a, high, high, a lot of energy. Uh, they got some uh, high-end skill up front and on, and on the back end. So uh, for us, I, I think, especially in this building, uh, they come out flying every, every game. So uh, that first 10 minutes is important here. So uh, we got to prepare for that tonight. Yep. Yep. You competed against Evander for years. You've been his teammate now for a couple of months. Anything surprising you learned about him or surprised you about him in the last um, I don't know. I, I think his nose for the net is something that, uh, uh, I mean, you, you kind of know as a as opposing player, but uh, you get a good sense of it when, when you're playing with him. And, uh, I mean, he just finds ways to score. He's, uh, he, he's always in the right spot to get a chance to score and uh, keeps the puck alive a lot. So it's, uh, it's really impressive. Obviously, he's had a lot of success in the league for a lot of years, so it's, uh, it's not surprising in that sense. But uh, definitely when you see it firsthand, it's, uh, it's impressive.